What's up, my bomb ass subscriber squad? What's happening, guys? Welcome, welcome, welcome. I'm your girl, Tanya Nicole. And today, guys, we have our Beauty Creations Mystery Box. Y'all, I got this in today. It's heavy. I'm excited and I want to get it open. So if you guys want to see what's inside of my Beauty Creations Mystery Box, please keep watching. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Leave me a comment down below. Y'all know I love chit-chatting it up. Welcome, welcome. I'm Tanya Nicole, your host for today <laughs> and every video, right? And welcome to my bomb ass unboxing world. Today I'm excited because we have our first mystery box in and it is the Beauty Creations mystery box. Y'all, I'm gonna give y'all some specs on this bad boy in a minute. But before we do that, y'all know what we gotta do. We want to give a big, huge shout out to my five first commenters from my last video. Thank you guys so much for waking up early and rocking with your girl, typing in your comments. I greatly appreciate you guys. For today's drink, we will be drinking the Spring Creek Pink Moscato here. Get my glass and pour us up some. Ooh, yeah. I hope y'all got y'all drinks and y'all snacks ready to party with your girl. Let's take a dance break and a drink break. Mm. Ooh, this one is, ooh, that one is really good. Just a couple quick announcements, guys. There will be no shout outs on Monday's video. And I'm not sure if I'm gonna have to evacuate yet because of this hurricane. But if we do, hopefully some of my boxes will be in before the weekend is up so that I can do some unboxings for Wednesday's and Friday's video. But if we have to evacuate, guys, and I don't get any boxes in, we'll have one for Monday, but I'm not sure about Wednesday or Friday. So y'all just say a little prayer for me that the weather is not too bad here and I can stay put, okay? Okay, now let's get on to the Beauty Creations Mystery Box. One of my subscribers uh, and followers on Instagram sent the link to me for this mystery box. I will put her name right here. Thank you, girl, because she already know that I love a mystery box. And this one actually was not that bad. There were two boxes available for the mystery box. The first one was $25. And this one, the one that I have, was $45. And this is called the Big Mystery Box. You're supposed to get five to 10 full-size products in here with a value of at least $80, guys. Yes. So the products in here ranges from their newest releases, some of their top sellers and must-haves. And this is the May Box, guys. So I don't even know. I'm sure this one is no longer available but um if they do have a june box i will be picking that one up as well but i did want to show you guys what they had in this box so without further ado <laughs> let's get this box on and popping boo <laughs> let's take a dance break and a drink break first so y'all know i can never find my scissors so i ordered these cute little box cutters on amazon I love them. It's so cute and small, so I can cut my boxes open. So we're gonna cut this open. Ooh, I hope I don't cut my finger. Let me put it down. Ooh, y'all ready? I hope they don't disappoint me. Oh gosh. This is what the inside of the box looks like. And y'all, I'm telling y'all, it's very, very heavy. They have beauty creations with the heart in the middle. I'm excited, y'all. So they have on here, you deserve it, babe, a little sticker right there that's very cute. They give us some cards, find your shades for their uh, beauty creations, flawless stay foundation. I didn't even know they had uh, foundations. The shade range is not that great, but that's what it looks like. And they also have some 3D silk lashes. Now, y'all know I'm definitely in two lashes. This is what that card looks like. And it's $4 a piece for these lashes. Everything is packaged nice separately in bubble wrap. So I, I do like that to avoid anything getting broken. So I'm happy about that. What I will try to do, guys, is find the prices for these uh, products on their site and put a retail price towards the end to see if we got at least our $80 value. Okay, cool. So let's see what this is. This is the first product. 
Let me get my box cutter. Girl, I like this little box cutter. I'm going to cut my finger, y'all. I'm telling you. <laughs> First thing out of the box is the Beauty Creations setting spray. Okay. I don't know what the... Oh, roses setting spray. And this is what the bottle looks like, guys, right there. And in here, you get four ounces of product. It does come with a little pump here. I am going to open it so I can smell it. Oh, it smells very, very strong of rose scent. And it doesn't say if it's a matte uh, setting spray or not. So when I'm looking up the price on this, if it says it, I'll put it down below. Let's test out this spritzer. Let's see. Okay, it's a nice mister, but I'm telling y'all, the rose scent is very fragrant. It's strong. So hey guys, this is our first product and I'm very excited about receiving a setting spray. Happy. Next up, we have something bubble wrapped. Okay, let's see. All right, and this time we have the Unicorn Dream Highlighter Palette right here. Gorgeous packaging. And when we take it out of the box, we have this right here. I'm not going to put it close because I don't want to blind you guys. And this is what it looks like, guys. This is not a shadow at the bottom. It's two shades in each one. So that is very, very pretty. And we're going to swatch these. I'm going to just do both shades mixed together. They do feel really nice. That's what they look like on my fingers. They are a little bit powdery, but oh, they're very pretty. Let the color swatched out right there. So yes, guys, they look very pretty. They are, like I said, a little powdery, but I think a lot of skin tones can actually wear this palette. So, okay, cool. I don't know what I want to open next. Everything is just so like nicely bubble wrapped, guys. I don't know what to open. Let's go with this one. So this is, let's open this up. And I love that they have a little sticker on the back here, Beauty Creations. I like that personal little touch. So first up, I am seeing the Beauty Creations Angel Glow palette here. I'm assuming it's a palette. Let's see. I haven't used a lot of Beauty Creations products. So, um, oh, it is. And girl, girl, oh, we got a mirror. <laughs> hey, boo. Does come with this little plastic, guys. And this is really pretty. Now, I do like these highlighter shades right here. They are gorgeous. Again, I think this is very universal. I think a lot of skin tones will be able to use this palette. I hope you guys can see the different colors. It is gorgeous. I'm not going to swatch this one because I'm not sure yet what I want to do with it, but it is a beautiful highlighter palette. Next up, guys, we have um, this Boho Babe palette here. This one is a 16 shade eyeshadow palette. And let's see. Oh, I love the packaging. It's so cute, so chic, you know, so like California is. <gasps> oh my God. Girl, girl, look, we got another mirror. <laughs> hey, honey. Oh my God. Now, this is a beautiful palette. We have shimmers and mattes, but it's a lot of range of colors, beautiful colors to create a lot of looks. I absolutely, now I really like this palette. I am really feeling this palette. And guys, it matches the theme of the cover. I love that. Y'all know we got to swatch some, right? Absolutely. Oh, they feel nice. Those are the four shades there. That's one swatch each. They didn't really swatch too well, but of course the shimmers did. I do like the palette and I'm very excited to try this baby out. Gorgeous. Next up, we're gonna go with this one here. Okay, so we have next up two other products here that came wrapped together. I hope I can get, there we go. Two products that came wrapped together. This one says irresistible right there. And this one says butterfly. So let's see. Let's do butterfly first because I do love butterflies. Okay, does come with a plastic, guys, and a mirror. <laughs> hey, girl. And ooh, this one is like, now I don't really get butterflies from this. I would think of butterflies being like purples and greens and pinks, I guess maybe, but it's a beautiful, beautiful neutral palette. We have some shimmer shades again, some matte shades. I think this is a beautiful universal palette as well. 
gorgeous. I really like this. This is definitely up my alley. And now let's look at Irresistible. And what colors would you expect to see in Irresistible? I don't know. I would think like reds and blues, I guess. How you open this? Wait. Girl, I put a little bit of highlighter right there. I touched my face. And now I got some highlighter right there, I guess. Okay, that's fine. Whatever. All right, y'all. I'm going to have to rip it because I, I can't get it open. All right. So this is the Irresistible one. We have uh, another mirror with a plastic. Hey, girl. Girl, this highlighter thing is ridiculous. <laughs> And this is the palette here, Irresistible. We have a little bit more of the reds and the pinks, browns, golds. Another universal palette, very neutral, very pretty. I think a lot of people will get a lot of use out of this palette. It's gorgeous. I absolutely love it. Okay, so far I'm impressed with Beauty Creations um, mystery box. It's a lot of palettes. So if you're a palette freak like me, you would definitely like this box. But if not, then uh, I don't know. And oh, okay. Okay. All right. I guess we really saved the best for last. So last up, we have these two here, contour and highlighting. Okay. Let's do highlight palette first. It's got a little tape here. Let me get my little box cutter. Let's cut that. So we're gonna open up highlight first. It does have a mirror, but it's frosted out, so I can't really see myself. It does come with this little brush here. And, oh, I like that it folds back. That's perfect. This is the highlight palette. Now, I must say, I do like this palette. Um, these two shades just look very similar to me, uh, but I do like it. I think that it's different and out of the box for highlighters, I guess, but the colors are gorgeous. And I think if you can't use it for highlighters, you can definitely use it as like toppers for your eyeshadow or something like that. But I am going to swatch them. Oh, it feels so pretty. Ooh, that's how they look on my fingertips, guys. And that's how they look swatched out. I hope you guys can see that. Very pretty, beautiful, definitely uh, shades that I can work with. Looking forward to using this. And last up, we have the contour palette here. This is what it looks like. I had to cut the little thing off. And comes with a little brush as well. And it does have a mirror that's frosted out, as you guys can see. Now, I don't know really if this will even work for me. I'm not sure. But the contour shades are beautiful. They're nice. Look like cool tone shades. This one may work for me, but I'm not going to swatch it because I'm not sure. And I don't want to not use it if I swatch it and it doesn't work. So I may give this one away, put this one in a giveaway, but the colors are gorgeous. So let's take a quick little drink before we recap. I'm going to hold up all the products that we received in our box. We're supposed to get from five to 10 products, I think they said. So let's see. Two, four, five, six, seven, eight products in this mystery box. Final thoughts on this mystery box was I really enjoyed this box. They do give you a lot of palettes. If you are a palette freak, highlighter freak, you will definitely love these products. I am surprised though that they didn't put like a beauty sponge or some lashes in the box, it's mostly like palettes and stuff. I don't have an issue with palettes. I just wish for a bit more variety of their products. Like, you know, if they have sponges, put a sponge. If they have lashes, put a pair of lashes. You know, I don't really shop with Beauty Creations too often, so I don't really know what they have. But if they had like more translucent powders or something more universal that people can use, like maybe a lipstick or a lip gloss or something like that, I think it would have made the box better. But we did get a lot of palettes. We did get a lot of variety. We got a setting spray, a contour palette. So I am really pleased with the box. But I'm just saying, guys, for a mystery box, I would like to have seen like lipsticks, maybe lashes, maybe a sponge or something else just to showcase the products that you have 
in your stock, right? But other than that, like I said, I think it was a great mystery box. I definitely think it was worth my $45. I will put the total somewhere around here and I enjoyed it. I will let you guys rate this box for me. Tell me your thoughts in the comments down below as well as your rating for this box on a scale of one, being this box is garbage. Throw the damn fire! <laughs> to five, being this box is the bomb.com. You let me know down below what your rating is for this box and we'll talk about it. Okay, y'all? Cool. So guys, that is all that I have for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed this mystery unboxing with your girl. Don't forget, if you haven't done so already, go ahead and smash that subscribe button. Be a part of my bomb ass subscriber squad, guys. We're almost at 3,000 and I am so excited. Give this video a big thumbs up if you do enjoy mystery unboxings because I have one more that's coming in the mail. It's a secret. I'm not going to tell you guys, but I'm very excited for it. Don't forget to follow me on Instagram and Twitter. All of those links are down below. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I will see you down in the comments and on Monday's video, which is going to be a get ready with me using some drugstore products and y'all... It's a hot mess, so y'all need to tune in. <laughs> so you guys be safe. Say a prayer for me and anybody that's in the track of this hurricane, guys, that everything is okay. I greatly appreciate you guys. I will see you all later. Bye.